guys, it's Julia and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys my 2020 goals and like my reflection of those goals and then also my new goals for 2021. These goals are going to be more just about reading and my YouTube channel so let's jump right into it. So for my goals from last year I set my goal to 50 books and I'm currently at I think 47 with a few days left in the year so my goal like I think I'm still gonna achieve my 50 I really hope so but that is hopefully a goal that I'm gonna meet for this year uh reflecting on some of my old goals I had a goal f to reach 25k this year which I did not do uh which is okay so that's one of my goals for next year is to hit 25k but I you know I didn't upload as much this year and there was obviously a lot of things going on this year and yeah I just wasn't as consistent on YouTube so it doesn't really surprise me that I didn't gain so many like a certain amount of subscribers or I didn't um my views are down and things like that so like I I kind of get why uh, well I get I understand why so yeah but it's just something that I'm going to be working towards in 2021. With that I was also not too consistent in 2020 I think I did maybe like at least a video a month but like that's about it and yeah, it was kind of disappointing, but I still really like the videos that I did put out and I feel like I have I have logged a lot this year towards the end of the year at least So I have so many memories to look back on and that's exactly what I want and that's what I want for vlogs And you guys also seem to really enjoy the vlogs. So th At least that's good. <laughs> I did not do any journaling videos like I wanted to but that's another goal that we're carrying on because I did not do that. So I did vlog more and then my, one of my goals was to host like another readathon. I'll have my goals video from last year linked if you're interested, but I want to host like another readathon, but I hosted Cramathon and then I hosted the Hannibal along on Instagram. So that Jesse asked me to help with. So yeah, then my last goal was to post videos that I'm proud of. So I, I would say that I'm pretty proud of most of the videos that are yeah, pretty much <laughs> most of the videos that I uploaded this year. I feel like I worked really hard on them and yeah, honestly, I feel pretty good about it. So yeah. So going into my goals for 2021, I want to read 80 books this year. Uh, I know it's a little bit of a, <laughs> like 50 for me. I used to always reach 50, always. Like I would set it to 50 and then when I hit 50, I set it to 100. And in past years, I've hit like 160, 120, um, 100. And then this year it's like 50 which is okay. <laughs> but the next year I want to do it like 80 and I want to really prioritize reading because I feel like I'm at my happiest and I'm at my most peaceful self as well when I'm reading and consuming so many stories. And I just think it's, it's overall good for me and it's something I really, really enjoy and that I need to prioritize more. I also want to upload more consistently. This is probably going to be a goal for a lot of people, but I would love to upload like at least once a week. And interact with you guys more in the comments like I, I already do comment back and things like that but I just really want to have like a nice little community on my channel and I want you guys to feel welcome here and that you can come say hi and I don't know stuff like that so that's what I want for 2021. I also want to make journaling videos and more vlogs. I, I just want to incorporate more things that I like to do for my person like other things and other hobbies that I have other than just reading so I want to kind of incorporate more of that on my channel too. Next is to make videos I'm proud of. I usually put this up every year just to even with school goals it's always like to submit projects that I'm proud of. It's just when you feel good about something and then you put it out it's just it's a good feeling when you finally finish like you do all the work for a video you edit upload not edit, <laughs> you film edit upload do all the planning for the video before that and then do the thumbnail and then it gets out into the world and you're just kind of you're pretty proud of it and yeah it's always a nice feeling so that's what I want going into the new year. The last one is try not to focus on views too much so I know that my views haven't been as good this year like I've, I've noticed like I see my analytics you know um, and it's really discouraging but I'm just gonna kind of keep pushing because you know the people that enjoy my videos will come back and the people that support me like actually support me and that's just really nice so I appreciate you so much if you watch my videos or you comment or give them a like just <laughs> thank you yeah those are all the goals that I had written down but I have a few more reading goals like there's some manga series that I want to keep reading like I want to keep reading The Girl from the Other Side I want to keep reading that I kind of want to continue with Sailor Moon as well if I end up getting those volumes I also want to prioritize just reading books that are just not talked about a lot but that are just interesting to me uh or even if they are talked about a lot just books that just that are just interesting to me like things like the necronomicon or like a book on the dark arts like stuff like that i kind of i have those so i want to read that and then 
I also am going to be reading like a lot of mythology books next year. Like I read quite a few this year, but I'm also going to read some next year. Like um, I'm going to be reading the Odyssey for class and annotating that. So that's going to be an interesting time. So yeah, I'm just going to be doing like some reading for school, but I also want to prioritize just reading things that, you know, I just think sound pretty cool. So that's about it. <laughs> yeah, there you guys have it. That was my little short video about my goals from last year and my goals going into 2021. So again, to reiterate my 2021 goals, I want to read 80 books. I want to upload more consistently. I would like to do more vlogs. I would like to do journaling videos. I want to be proud of the videos I upload. I want to read books that just seem interesting to me and that are not super talked about or about subjects that I'm interested in. I want to upload more consistently, like at least once a week. So those are my goals going into 2021. And yeah, we'll see what this year is going to bring. <laughs> I'm very interested and kind of scared to see what this year is going to bring, but I hope you guys are all doing okay and staying safe, and I will see you guys super soon. Uh, I hope you had a good holiday, and I hope that you have a good New Year's, and wish you guys all the best for 2021, so I will talk to you guys super soon with a new video. Bye!